now that I've seen every single season of Smallville, you know your boy, it's time to rank them all from worst to best. So sit back, relax and enjoy the three minute long video of ranking Smallville seasons. At number 10, it pains me to say it, but season 7 has got to be the worst season by far of this show. Hey, hold up. I don't hate any season of this show, this is why it makes it intensely hard for me to rank Smallville. But 7 has got to go at 10th place because I've just found the storylines a little boring. Yeah, you got Kara, but Lauren Vandervoort isn't my favourite interpretation of Supergirl, uh, Melissa is. And you actually got Lexi's dark side in this one, which is actually pretty good. Number 9 is season 3 for me. Hey, listen, the first episode of season 3, the first episode of season 3 was very promising. And it didn't go downhill, like, it's just I didn't find it the best season. Number 8 for me has got to be season 6. Listen, the highlights for this season were all the Green Arrow stuff and the Justice League stuff, and this is where we got the Justice League run-up. And, yeah, I, I like this season. It, it, it's entertaining. Seventh place is season four. I actually really enjoyed this season more, more than most people. You got the introduction of The Flash in this, you got the introduction of Lois Lane in this, and overall, it's a very enjoyable season and very fun to watch. This pains me to put this at sixth place, but I actually really love season five. You get Brainiac in this, and you get Lex going total bad guy mode. I love it. Number five is season one. This is a very enjoyable season. I love the pilot to this season. It's very, very good. But then you get the Freak of the Week formula, which is all right, but very overdone. Number four is season 10. The final episode to this is absolutely mesmerizing. Clark Kent jumping off the building, opening his chest, and then you see the Superman emblem. And he is officially Superman in this season. I love this season, but it was only really the final episode that was the best. Number three is season nine. I love this season, hands down. I, I, I really love it. It's probably one of the best DC shows this season in particular. You get Hawkman, you get the JSA, you get Justice League, you get Doctor Fate. And you get the proper first, proper Superman suit, which is the black one, and I love his look in this one. This was going to be number one. Season two is happily sitting at number two because I love this season inside out. And you get Christopher Reeve in this season. And you actually name drop Krypton in this one. But for me, number one has to be season eight. I am so sorry a lot of people hated this season. You get Doomsday in this season. Yeah, Davis Bloom Doomsday. Jimmy Olsen dies. Lois Lane and Clark is a very good combo. What can I say? This season is just has it all and it was peak fiction and I watched it in two days. What's your ranking?